Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. And as you can see, we've already started here. Loose ball, who's going to get there? He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. Kepa sends that a long way. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Dallas. Phillips just brushed off the ball there. As Piliqueta tries to get it forward quickly. William. Conte. Tries to switch the play. Pulisic. Click spreads it towards the left. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Emerson. Looking cross-field, changing the point of attack. And here's Lukaku. Lukaku. Plays it out to the wing. Whipped in. And the first 45 minutes are up. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Some first-half thoughts. It's been a pretty abject performance. No efforts at goal. I'm struggling to remember the last time we had that. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. And the game has already resumed here. Nil-nil then, and we're back on the way. It's come through. Balls come loose, and the chase is on. William displaying his defensive capabilities there. That's no striker's tackle. You have to admire commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Into the channel. Out towards the flank. Nice touch. Massive leap! Good ball there! And in it goes! And that is the goal we've all been yearning for. Kiko Casilla reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. That's just great play, Peter. A textbook example for any wannabe footballers out there on positioning and movement. Chelsea take the lead. Well, that's the currency he deals in, and he's come good yet again. Never the one to let you down in these situations. Bamford. Could cross it here. 
keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Bamford. Bamford! It's broken loose. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Dallas. They're playing as if time is on their side when it's, it's fast running out. They've got to quicken this up. Almost. And that's it. Chelsea win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, one nil. Well, this game looked to have nil-nil written all over it, but credit to them. They